Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars diecast review. Today we're going to take a look at Mallory Car Hut, the ghost car from the Cars on the Road episode Lights Out. Before we get right into the review and the retrospective, let's start with the unboxing. Here we've got his artwork for Cars on the Road, the Carberry County Desert background, 2023, Cars on the Road, name branding Mallory Car Hut, his die cast sealed in, the Salt Flats map background, the Metal logo, and the Mattel logo. And on the back, we have the Salt Flats map background, as seen in, Cars on the Road logo, Metal logo, Road Rumblers Mater, that I, who I, which I don't have. Matteo, who I don't have. Westalampolis, who, which I don't have. Mato, who I don't have. Griswold, who I don't have. And a car, Stegosaurus car-like, whatever it is. Tell me, tell me. Please tell me the name of this dinosaur car in the comments down below. 2021 Mattel, made in Thailand, Mattel, empowering the next generation through play, Disney slash Pixar, www.disney.com slash cars. And now without any further ado, let's dig right into the unboxing. Here we have Mallory Car Hut all opened up and out of the package. <clears throat> Mallory Car Hut is a car with a late 1930s body style who resi currently resides in a picture portrait at a hotel and was voiced by Ruth, Ruth Livier who also happened to have voiced one of the ghost car twins, Lisa or Louise. Tell me who Ruth Livier voiced in the comments down below. And she also bears a similar body to River Scott, which I don't have the normal River Scott. Anyhow, during her appearance in the Cars on the Road episode, Showtime, she was seen moving, she along with other ghost cars were seen moving out of several picture portraits and chasing down Lightning McQueen during his nightmare or his imagination or both and was then seen dancing along with other ghost cars and and they even danced with Lightning McQueen, even though he was still scared. And during his diecast, during her diecast releases, she was released only one time as a single, and hasn't received a single re-release ever since. And now, without any further ado, let's dig right into the review. Here we have her happy, chaotic, happy facial expression, her glow-in-the-dark green paint, her grill, her headlights and bumper, and her partial teeth, which she is missing some, missing a tooth, and her radiator cap, no tampons on the hood, just her one side view mirror, and her cap and on both sides we've got her door and glow in the dark green tires and on the back we have the back windows and her, and her back bumper and the license plate saying the license plate saying K06-29A 
N. And on the undercarriage, it says Disney slash Pixar, made in Thailand, 2022 Mattel. Oh, and I forgot to mention the exhaust pipes. And that is it. And now let's pull up some of the other ghost cars. We have Lisa and Louise, the ghost car twins, and some more deceased cars. We have Mrs. Linda, the King Weathers, since her voice actress, Linda Petty, he died in 2014. Lee Weathers, another who Lee Weathers, the grandfather of the father of Strip the King Weathers, who since he since his base is Lee Petty, the father of Richard Petty, the voice of Strip the King Weathers, and grandfather of Cal Weathers' voice actor, Kyle Petty, died in 2000. Dale, the Intimidator Earnhardt Sr., the son of Dale Earnhardt Jr., Junior Moon, since his actor, Junior Johnson, died in 2019. Rod Tork Redline, Queen Elizabeth II, since the real Queen Elizabeth II died in 2022. And last but not least, of course, Doc Hudson. And that is it. So what do you guys think? Which ghost car is your favorite? Is it Mallory Carhut or Lisa and Louise. And which deceased car is your favorite as well? Let me know what you think as well as leaving suggestions in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Also, don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye now!